None of us wants to ponder what life would be like if we lost a limb, but a new change in policy for the New York State of Health marketplace just made life more manageable for thousands. At issue was how often and how many prosthetic limbs could be replaced for New Yorkers who rely on what is commonly known as Obamacare. Heidi Siegfried with New Yorkers for Accessible Health Coverage says New Yorkers will now be covered if they outgrow prosthetic limbs or if the limbs simply wear out over time. So this means that people will not have to pay out of pocket anywhere from five to $80,000 to replace a limb, which they do need replacement like every three to five years. Siegfried says New York lawmakers are also debating a long-term fix this session that would make coverage for these prosthetic devices a matter of law in New York. Solomon Wold is a type 1 diabetic from the Bronx who has two prosthetic devices from leg amputations. The loss of a kidney qualified him for Medicaid, and as a result, his limb replacements are covered. Still, he is concerned about other uninsured fellow New Yorkers who need state lawmakers to take action. If you don't have insurance, that means I couldn't leave my house. I couldn't go to the hospital or uh, to visit a friend. I cannot do anything. That means... This is very important thing for people They lose their limbs, so they have to fix uh, the policy. Siegfried says the replacement issue is important considering the number of New Yorkers who lose a limb each year. In New York in 2012, there were hundreds of people getting upper limb amputations and thousands of people that needed below the knee and above the knee amputations each year. And then, of course, they're going to need repair and replacement. Siegfried says this is one positive sign as to how Obamacare rules can be improved to meet the changing needs and gaps in coverage for New Yorkers. Mike Clifford, New York News Connection.